Oh, good morning, South Florida. I'm Andrew Perez. Here's a look at stories making headlines this morning. A really intense fire in Miami Gardens at a storage facility, sending one firefighter to the hospital. Fire rescue responded to reports of a fire at extra space storage on Northwest 2nd Avenue, right near 176th Street Saturday morning. Smoke seen billowing above that building. One firefighter was transferred to an area hospital where we're told he had minor injuries. The cause of the fire remains under investigation. We're also seeing some incredible video captured after an SUV plunged off an I-95 overpass. The vehicle landed in the 300 block of Flagler Street. Video shows bystanders jumping to help pull the victim to safety. According to Miami Fire Rescue, the patient in the car was stable and taken to the hospital just as a precaution after this accident. He is expected to be okay. Deputies, meanwhile, investigating a shooting in Pompano Beach that sent one man to the hospital. They responded near the intersection of Northwest 19th Avenue and 4th Street around 1 a.m. Saturday, where they found a man suffering from multiple gunshot wounds. He was taken to the hospital for treatment, is expected to survive his injuries as well. Deputies are now searching for the shooter. Drivers showcased high performance cars for charity, providing blind students with a pretty unique experience here. The Miami Lighthouse, a nonprofit, gave more than 50 students the chance Saturday afternoon to rev up the engines of some of the most exotic cars in the world. The students were able to take a spin with an accompanied driver, making for an unforgettable day for all of them. Remember, as breaking news happens, we've got you covered on air, but also online. You can head to our website, local10.com, for more.